Tonight, a woman and her boyfriend could go to prison in the shooting death of a seven year old boy. The boy is the woman's son. This was the scene on Cleveland's West Side three weeks ago. Today, charges were handed down in the case. Our Lydia Esparra has the latest. It was here at this home on West 30th. First responders rushed to a child injured with a gun. Here is the scanner traffic. There's blood on the scene here, but uh, they haven't made an entry yet. I don't believe the juvenile's here. In early March, somehow, seven-year-old Demetrius Dunlap found the weapon. Now let's say there was sleep missing on the car shot. Police say he shot himself, and someone in this house drove the injured child to Metro. You advise Metro? As police began their investigation. I'm Charlie 17. I'm out on West 30th. I do have a firearm. Charlie 17, don't touch that. Is anyone at the house with you? Demetrius died at the hospital. On Wednesday, 28-year-old Brian Irby and the boy's mother, 28-year-old Shartika Mock, were indicted by a grand jury. And tonight, they face involuntary manslaughter charges. I need somebody at the scene. Start a crime scene log and hold that scene. On Mock's Facebook page, she mentions losing her beloved son. And now police say Mock and Irby are responsible for her son Demetrius's death. That's Brian Irby. He does have an active CCW permit. The seven-year-old's death has been ruled accidental, but the county prosecutor says it could have been prevented. Mock and Irby are due back in court on April 20th. In Cleveland, Lydia Spara, 3 News.